The defense for a woman accused of not reporting her husband's death while still collecting his benefits has hired psychiatrists to help determine whether she's competent to stand trial. But Isla Solomon still insists her husband had only been dead for five days when his body was discovered last year. Solomon is accused of keeping Gerald Scooter Gavin's body inside their Shawnee Avenue home for nine months after his death. Solomon says she left the home two days after he died, and she believes that's when someone placed several kerosene heaters and dehumidifiers inside the home to speed up the body's decomposition. She believes someone was trying to prevent her from making a claim to Gavin's trust fund. Although an autopsy determined Gavin died sometime in June of 2013, Solomon claims he died on April 28, 2014. Oh, it definitely was very far along. Scooter was a mummy. But there's a lot of people who know how to make a mummy. Solomon faces nine criminal charges, including welfare fraud and failure to report a dead body. She's scheduled to be evaluated on July 29th to determine whether she is competent to stand trial. A hearing has been scheduled for August 14th.